best CFR. Okay. It's kind of an easy five hour game which is story driven. Oh, speaking of um, easy five hour games, story driven games, did you buy that um, uh, bundle for Ukraine thing? I, 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 as soon as I found out about it, I bought it. So, like, we've got games for days, boys. Games for days. Like, it included, like, a super hot in there, which I wanted to get eventually on sale anyway. So, the fact that I had that amongst others, I was just like, give me this game right now, bruh. Bruh. the planet except for Francis and Edgar okay. except for you and Dr. Oh, okay oh, I see I see I see I see I want to look at all the open ones, so let's look at um, you first. Nice. I saw it, I could not. That many games would give me analysis paralysis and I would never play a single one. Dude. Um. So, from what I understand with the itch.io bundle, um, they don't automatically install. Um, and you have to literally search for them within, like, your user account in order to install them. So, I think you can also search by tag and by name. So, like, you, you should buy it. It's like ten, $10. Um, and, like, they've got some uh, really good games, like... For example, a long time ago on stream, I played and completed a game called A Short Hike. That's in there. You've got Super Hot. That's in there. Um, what's another one? They've got a few in there. Like a few like classic games, I guess you could say. I'll be back. Need to get another happy hour drink. Get that drink. Get that drink. Also, my life is a mess, I just want everything in Steam. I understand that. Like, um, uh, I'll, I'll save my spiel for when you get back, okay? So yeah, enjoy your drink. Ah, let me, let me see, like we've got the, uh, uh was it Cheers? Shit, um, I I've got emotes, but mm, let me see. Access it from within here. Better TV settings here. Um, I want access to my emote thing. Will it let me? There we are. Okay. So I wanted to do which one? This one here. Happy cheers, okay. There you go. Alright, anyway. Diana, dirty Diana. Info, hell yeah. Nice. Nice.
but it's either like hot or is it? It's freezing. All right, let's do um, let's do Karakum HR. What was I about to say? It was like a spiel that I was about to go into. Okay, yeah. So, um, I thought as you did. However, like being um, a, a member of Amazon Prime, not only do I get the free Amazon Prime thing a, a month, every month they give, um, they basically give out games for free. But, Sometimes they're on GOG, sometimes they're on the uh, the Origin launcher, which I refuse to use. But there's also some on the Epic Games launcher, and I've, I've capitulated. Because in the past they've offered games like Alien Isolation for free, but I've refused to use it because, ooh, it's epic. But here's the way I look at it now. If I'm getting them for free, then... It, I'm, I'm okay with that. I'm never going to spend money on the Epic platform, but I will take the games for free. So, I've got my uh, um, Epic um, uh, launcher. I now have something like five or six free Amazon games on there. Um, some of them are quite expensive, I think, still. Like, there's a Surviving Mars. There was a Frostpunk. Um, the Ghost Runner, I think, was GOG. Um... Yeah, but they've, they've released a couple games on there. Um, there's also ones for Amazon. So what I've done for the Amazon ones is I've claimed them, but I've never installed the client because it's Windows only. But, you know, eventually if I get bored and I hop back into the Windows um, drive that I have, yeah, I could play those games. They're all for free. So it's just like, you know, add them for free, and then if and when I want to use them, I'll access them. And, you know, I'm not pirating. Like, I legally got them. It's odd you streamed early and don't get a lot of viewers when you are off schedule. Oh, uh, <laughs> I don't really care about viewers, dude. Like, for um, me, my schedule has been weird anyway. I tell people, like, oh, no, I'm going to stream at these times. But, like, except for the Sunday stream, it usually never really lines up lately, so... I just felt like today, like I'm locked in, there's, there's nothing happening that I need to attend to, I feel good, and I thought, yeah, yeah, yeah let's, let's bang out a stream today. But yeah, I really do need to kind of, yeah, work on that stream schedule, get a bit more regular. games now is the main cost is my time. It is. I would rather replay a game as a viewer watching someone I consider to be a friend and good person than play the latest thing. Aww. Could you perhaps be referring to me? But, but doesn't it kind of irk you a bit when like a game that you perhaps really like and their reaction is like eh. I guess it's like, you know, it's interesting to see that perspective too. But you know, like when you show a friend like uh, music that you really like and they're like indifferent or like they hate it, and you're like, oh, well then. Can I check out Adrian's folder? What's in all Adrian's folder? I really appreciate you getting around to this and knew you would, and you even pinged me on Discord so I could see it live. Yeah, I try. I do try. Money, money, money. 
encourages growth in many pie and bar charts. Quite a bit of information now. Quite a few numbers. Um, hmm. Can I get some uh, help from Akara? Yeah. Diana. Dirty Diana. Which could evolve into live streaming friendship virtual meetups like this, I would approve. I mean, kind of really is, isn't it? I mean, like, um, there's like Zoom, and people incorporate like Zoom like sort of stuff within gameplay. I think there's always going to be that technological layer though, with uh, something like that. Unless we're talking transhumanism, like when we're a uh, part of the machines. I don't think I'd ever be a part of a machine. I don't think I'd like the, uh, the implications, even if it augmented me. I think I'd like to be El, El Natural. El Natural? Oh Natural. Anyway. So... We're gonna call... Diana's the voice profile, we're gonna call... Mm. Who should we call? Wait, actually, go back here. Diana and Larissa. Let's give it a try. Let's see what this yields. Uh, this game got you thinking. kind of has got me thinking, sure. But, um, my speculations have gone into the void. If you, if you weren't here for it and you're not watching the bots, they're in the void. But it's fine. Sometimes it's good to, to just air out what you're thinking. Um, how about... Yeah, we probably want to get Diana to call Francis, don't we? That's what it wants us to do, but 